Welcome one and welcome all to the People's Channel, Orchids for Dummies. In today's video, darling, I just want to give clarification on how I collect my rainwater. So, it is early in the morning. We just had a really bad storm last night that left a lot of water but did a lot of damage as well. You can see a lot of sediments, okay? This is what you don't want in your orchid pots, especially when you are growing with moss okay so what we're going to do is just pour it out you know i'm gonna show you real quick but you gotta stay tuned welcome on back to a no judgment zone orchids for dummies go ahead and like this video because you know you like it and I like you back. Okay. <laughs> so what I'm going to do is I have a pitcher. Okay. A gallon pitcher. And I'm going to put it in here to collect the water. And I have a couple of jugs. Recycling. Yes, God. And I'm going to um, put it in there. And that's how I'm going to store it. So here we go. I'm just going to do the best that I can. Okay. Okay. And I'm not going to get the sediments. The sediments are heavy. At the top, it's really clear. Now you see that? And you wanna make sure that you get it as soon as you can. So it will be as less, you know, um... Oh no. Hold on, honey, I think I see bugs. Okay, so if you see bugs, I poured that out. I don't know. I don't know. I have to investigate. Let me take a better look. So, Fail Pals, I was so excited to finally have rainwater. I was so excited. But as you can see, this is already filled with bugs. And um, no ma'am, no Pam. I don't do it. I don't do the bugs. So, this is going to get poured out. I'm going to go through the rest of the water, see if I can find anything bug free. And if I can't, then unfortunately, I will have to try something else. I thank you for being here. I thank you for staying tuned. Don't bring these bugs in your home, baby. Mm -mm, not today, boo-boo. So welcome back, Fail Pals. Thank you so much for staying tuned. Now, I think one of those flying bugs that I saw in the water did get into my home, but we will take care of it. Now, what we don't want is an infestation of those bugs. If you have an infestation of fungus nets, I will leave a video link, okay, so you will know how I got rid of mine. Oh, look at that beautiful bumblebee. Hey, little. Oh, that's not a bee. I don't know what the hell that is. Oh, it's gone just like that. Okay, so this water um, was from the jugs, and those jugs did not pour so much off of the roof. Okay, so you can see this is very clear. This is what you want. I think it was just one bug in here from, you know, that was left in here from um, the last segment. Okay, but it's going to be okay because one bug is okay. It's drowned versus bringing all of them in your home, girl. No, ma'am. Don't do that. Don't do it. Okay, so I'm going to just pour it in a jug. I hope it makes sense to you. I will show you if you want to see. Stay to me pouring the water out of the jug, okay, into here. Once I start to see all of these sediments going towards the front, then I'll just pour that out. But you can see this is really clear, okay? Clear water. It's about maybe one or two bugs in here, but that's okay. It's not as bad as you know, the last segment with the whole infestation, okay? See, it's already coming out. And because these bugs are so small, it's a possibility that those bugs could be on you. So make sure to take a nice bath, a good old bath, honey, a good old soak, honey, when you get through with this foolishness because you don't want to put it all in your furniture and stuff like that, girl. That's nasty. 
That's nasty. Welcome back, Fab Pals. Anytime you're dealing with rainwater and you're dealing with those jugs and stuff, it's going to be a... Uh, anytime it rains and be a downpour, it's going to be a strong chance some type of bugs will come into your home, honey. So you want to keep this type of um, pesticide <laughs> on your side. Okay, girl, Johnson to Johnson, get into it, honey. So um, this is one of those little grasshopper things, honey, and she thinks she is over here being slick. Now, also remember that when you have your orchids sitting right here, Okay, make sure that you're not spraying too much of it. So here we go. She thought she was being slick. No, ma'am, not, no, I don't do it. I don't do the bugs. Until next time.